my mother Gloria was a piano player, as was my father. And um, she liked her show tunes. She used to take me on the L train in Chicago to go get some special sheet music for her show tunes. <laughs> And, um, then she wrote some songs, and I had them on a cassette tape, <clears throat> and I passed it on to a musician who, I guess, is retired now and lost, lost it, and I really regret that, but she had written one Christmas song. Because she, she was a huge fan of, like, say, Judy Garland and Mickey Rooney and all those musicals. And we just sit and watch. Um, Meet Me in St. Louis or a lot of the old musicals together. And my dad loved that stuff, too. Um, so she had that sort of vibe going on playing the piano and she wrote a little song and it was called Going Home for Christmas and it was sort of in the vein of something like I don't know like Silver Bells or that sort of stuff and it was and I'm not a singer trust me <laughs> it was Going home for Christmas, I can hardly wait. Now it's near the date, hope I won't be late. Being home this season means so much, so much to me. Sorry, for it's Christmas time. People laughing in the new fallen slow snow. Uh, People, la, 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 being home this season means so much to me. For it's Christmas time. And that, that was my mom. She wrote many songs. She wrote songs about rainbows and butterflies and, you know, don't you know to have a rainbow first there must be rain and a butterfly won't reach the sky until he tries and tries again there are many things worth sharing it just takes a little caring and a little minute of your day and that was my mom. She was a very, very kind and nice lady. And she grew up as a product of her times, as did I. And that was her legacy. My beautiful, wonderful mother, Gloria Ann Mountain Crowley.